Movement Electronic Music Festival is an annual electronic dance music event held in Detroit each Memorial Day weekend since 2006. Previous electronic music festivals held at Hart Plaza on Memorial Day weekend include Detroit Electronic Music Festival 2000 to 2002, Movement 2003-2004, and Fuse In 2005. The four different festival names reflect completely separate and distinct producers, brands and directions. All of these festivals presented performances by musicians and DJs that emphasized the progressive qualities of the culture surrounding electronic music including the celebration of Detroit being the birthplace of the popular electronic music subgenre techno. In late 2013, the original DEMF management announced plans for the return of the Detroit Electronic Music Festival as a free admission event at Campus Martius Park on Independence Day weekend, 2014, along with the Paid Admission Federation of Electronic Music Technology a concurrent conference and music showcase at Ford Field. These events were later rescheduled for 2015. These events are not connected to the Movement Electronic Music Festival planned for Memorial Day weekend in Hart Plaza. In 2017, Movement was nominated for Festival of the Year at the Electronic Music Awards. Topic: History The first electronic music festival held in Detroit was the Detroit Electronic Music Festival in 2000, produced by Carol Marvin and her organization Pop Culture Media, which included longtime event producer Adriel Thornton, Tello Dunn, and Barbara Deo and others. Taking place in Detroit's Hart Plaza, it was a landmark event that brought visitors from all over the world to celebrate techno music in the city of its birth. The event was one of the first electronic music festivals in the United States. Topic 2000 successful launch. The first DEMF occurred in May 2000 and concluded with few hitches and no reported crime. It was applauded by city leaders and tourism officials as an injection of youthful energy into the city. As Tom Thews the co-founder of the Detroit Electronic Music Festival gives credit, "...without the help of Stephen Sowers, the owner of Motor Lounge Detroit, not only would we have not had been able to have a successful festival, but there would not have been a festival at all. Motor Detroit laid the foundation and groundwork for the Detroit Electronic Music Festival." Motor sponsored a prominent stage at the festival where some of the world's top artists performed. Motor Lounge was the Billboard magazine's number 13 top 25 dance clubs in the world of all time. Attendance at the first DEMF surpassed expectations, with estimates over the three day run surpassing 1 million visitors. Subsequent festivals drew even bigger crowds. City officials and others, including media observers and local businesses, saw the apparent economic boost to the city, with the Visitors and Convention Bureau stating that in only its second year, the event had pumped over $90 million into the local economy. Topic: 2001-2002 DEMF growth and controversy. In the festival's second year and beyond, many independently organized and impromptu techno music parties packed Detroit and Windsor area clubs and makeshift venues early into each morning during the festival's run. Ford Motor Company provided an unprecedented $435,000 for title sponsorship of the 2001 event, which was renamed the Focus Detroit Electronic Music Festival. This allowed the free-of-charge event to continue to be a gift to the fans and made the festival a profitable venture in its second year. Festival producer Pop Culture Media, with Carol Marvin at the helm, worked with Ford to create a nationwide television ad campaign featuring the music of Detroit techno founder Wan Atkins. Controversy ensued when producer Carol Marvin reluctantly fired artistic director Carl Craig for breach of contract. Topic 2003-2004 Movement. 
In January 2003, Detroit City Mayor Kwame Kilpatrick decided to override the Recreation Department which controls and manages Hart Plaza and secured Hart Plaza and the Memorial Day weekend dates for Derek May, who had extensive experience as a touring DJ but no first-hand, large-scale festival production experience. May put a first-class team in place, which included a donation by Philadelphia-based PAWN Lasers, Louis Kappa 26, but the biggest hurdle faced by the festival was the city of Detroit's withdrawal of $350,000 funding that it had provided in previous years. The Second Movement Festival took place in 2004, but despite its public success, the event faced significant financial losses and its fate became uncertain. Topic 2005 Fuse In. In February 2005, May announced his resignation as festival producer, and the festival once again changed hands. Fellow techno veteran Kevin Saunderson announced plans for a movement replacement to be called Fuse In Detroit, later shortened to just Fuse In, with the tagline "Detroit's Electronic Movement" to be staged Memorial Day weekend 2005. Successful negotiations with city officials led to 2005 becoming the first year that an event in Hart Plaza did not have free admission. A total of 41,220 admission passes were sold to Fuse in visitors. 38,382 daily passes were sold for $10 each, and 2,838 weekend passes, covering the full three days, were sold for $25 each. The city of Detroit collected $1 per pass, and was to have collected 30% of festival profits, but admission pass sales did not recoup the festival's $756,000 budget. 1. <laughs> 2006 present movement On February 16, 2006, Kevin Saunderson announced that due to financial losses and lack of sufficient promotion, he would not continue to produce the festival in 2006. As of March 23, Paxahau of Detroit, Michigan, an event production company that has worked with Craig, May, and Saunderson, secured the venue and dates from Saunderson to produce the festival under the name, Movement. Paxahau has been producing their festival from 2006 to present, celebrating their 10-year anniversary in 2016. 2007 – Movement In 2007 the festival took place over a span of three days, May 26 to May 28, 2007. Topic 2008 Movement. In 2008, the festival took place over a three-day span, May 24 to May 26, 2008. Ticket prices this year were set at $40 presale or $55 at the door for a weekend pass, and $175 for a VIP pass. Topic. 2009 – Movement Movement 2009 took place from Saturday May 23, 2009 through Monday May 25, 2009 in Hart Plaza in Detroit, Michigan. These two mobile-friendly sites include information about after-parties, lodging and an easy-to-read schedule https colon slash slash web dot archive dot org slash web slash two oh oh nine oh five two three oh nine four two one oh slash http colon slash slash www.b dot com slash demp slash or http colon slash slash www.detroitlove dot com the weekend overlaps with Couchsurfing's event couch crash http colon slash slash spreadsheets dot google com ccc key equals p four o one urshreyofub nine cmcig and with the international sword fighting and martial arts convention topic twenty ten movement movement twenty ten took place may twenty nine to thirty one twenty ten
This was the tenth anniversary of Detroit's yearly electronic music festival. Plasticman confirmed his appearance on his official website. Two other confirmed artists include Mr. Scruff, Ida Engberg, Jamie Jones, and Woody McBride. Topic: 2011 Movement. Movement 2011 was held on May 28 to 30, 2011, and took place at Hart Plaza in Detroit, Michigan, the same location as every year since its inception. Featured artists this year include Fatboy Slim, Carl Craig, Beardy Man, Felix Da Housecat, and Skrillex. This year's secret artist listed on the lineup is Ricardo Villar Lobos, who, to the disappointment of many, was not allowed entrance into the U.S. last year. Topic: 2012 Movement. Movement 2012 was held on May 26–28, 2012 at Hart Plaza in Detroit, Michigan, the same location as every year since its inception. Topic 2013 – Movement Movement 2013 took place on May 25–27, once again in Hart Plaza. The lineup for the 2013 edition of the festival includes the following 116 acts. Topic 2014 Movement. Movement 2014 will take place on May 24 to 26, once again in Hart Plaza. The lineup three for the 2014 edition of the festival will include the following 121 acts four. Topic 2015 Movement Topic 2016 Movement Topic 2017 Movement Topic Attendance Historically, attendance of events held in Hart Plaza has often been reported as being well in excess of the 14-acre venue's capacity of 40,000 people, even when crowds were counted by police and city officials. The reported attendance estimates for the Electronic Music Festival were as follows DEMF 2000 to 1.1 to 1 1.5 million asterisk DEMF 2001, 1.7 million asterisk DEMF 2002, 1.7 million asterisk Movement 2003 to 630,000 Movement 2004 to 150,000 asterisk asterisk Fuse in 2005 to 44,920 asterisk 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 Movement 2006 to 41,000 asterisk 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 Movement 2007 to 43,337 asterisk 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 Movement 2008 to 75,000 asterisk 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 Movement 2009 to 83,322 Movement 2010 to 95,000 Movement 2011 to 99,282 Movement 2012 to 107,343 Asterisk based on visual estimates by police and city officials, and conceded by city officials in 2003 to be an overly generous estimate. Asterisk asterisk reported by police on May 30, 2005. 5 Asterisk 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 41,220 ticket holders, plus 3,700 DJs, VIPs, and press, reported by the Detroit News and the Detroit Free Press on June 2, 2005. 6 7 Asterisk 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 41,000 tickets, quoted by Kevin Saunderson in Big Shot magazine. 8 Asterisk 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 reported by the Detroit Free Press on May 27, 2008. 
9 Topic See also List of electronic music festivals Detroit International Jazz Festival Topic Notes and references Topic external links Put Your Hands Up, an oral history of Detroit's Electronic Music Festival Detroit Techno and the Electronic Music Festival, Retrospective